Hey everybody, welcome back to the happy hour. Uh, we had a very good uh, first unboxing happy hour with our Cal Time unboxing on the last stream, or sorry, last video. Uh, you know, it's been a little little bit since we we did this, so we're coming back at it with a new one today. It's going to be a special Zendikar box that we'll have ready for you. And uh, I just want to thank everybody who uh, watched the video, subscribed, and participated in the giveaway. Uh, all the cards are out in the mail. Hopefully, uh, all the new guys uh, got got their cards uh, by now and are, are enjoying them. And uh, you know, the giveaway is still open. Not all the cards were uh, were taken. Uh, so for details for the giveaway, uh, started off right right off the bat. Uh, first ten uh, subscribers uh, to the channel, as well as following me on Twitter will get any card of their choice in this unboxing. Uh, so rolls to the last unboxing as well. We had four new subscribers. Uh, so they all got the cards of the cards of their choice uh, from the Cal time unboxing. Uh, so six more slots open for that. Plus another 10 on top for this video today. And if you are into the next set of 10 people and you like the Cal time stuff better than the stuff we're opening in Zendikar today, you can ask for one of those too. Uh, it's going to be a rolling first come first serve basis, uh, just so uh, you know. Give it to the people who get who get, who get here first. Um, so, uh, without further ado, we're going to get into a uh, special edition uh, Zendikar gift edition box. Okay, green screen doesn't play nicely with this. That's all right. I'll go to the top down view. There it is. Zendikar Rising gift edition box uh this one's not going to be as as lengthy as the last one uh there's only uh 10 packs in here uh but it comes with, with some nice things i'll uh, i'll take the shrink wrap off so it's a little easier to see this but a lot of foils going on with this box a lot of foils going on wrap off of course be chatting along the way talking about the cards some good ones that we get out of here. And, uh, you know, maybe talk a little about the upcoming Strixhaven. Who's excited for that? Learn all these new cards. Previews have been going out for it. Looks like a lot of fun. New mechanics that I think are be really cool. Really, really cool for the game. All right, so Adventures Dream Score. So we're going to get uh, Spin Down Life Calendar. going to look pretty cool. 10 uh, draft boosters plus one collector booster. So cool. So 11 packs total here. Uh, we get the gift card box, which is good because I need a box to put all those cards in from the last video. Uh, alternative art premium foil, Charix the Raging Isle card. We'll check that out. And then 20 uh, premium foil and 20 regular basic land cards because everyone's favorite foil cards are land cards. Uh, we, all, we all know that. So here we go. Zendikar uh, gift and gift edition uh, un unboxing again uh, giveaway applies for this video uh, just like the last one device there box on the side. oh wow there's artwork inside the box too it's really hard oh, can it, oh, oh never mind it was just oh well the inside of the box looks pretty cool it's hard to see from how I angle. Yeah, yeah, look at all that cool stuff in there. Pretty wild. Off to the side. Put it down. Okay, so here's our big old foil art. Or it's not really foil art, uh, just a regular artwork. So it looks like a lithograph. I don't know who she is, but she's cool. I'm sorry, my knowledge is not as good as everybody else's on this. I told you, I'm, I'm really new to this. I just started playing like two months ago. Uh, again, who is she? She's awesome. I don't know who she is. And then on the back, oh, look at all these crazy guys. Arr! Singing from the mountaintops. I think I've seen this card before. I don't remember what it is exactly, though. Put that off to the side. All right, let's see what's in this little box right here. Probably the... Oh, no, this, oh, this is the box for, the, for your cards. Cool, how nice is that? We'll... Uh, Open it up. Let's put it back there so we can put our cards in there nice and neatly. And then I guess this is the card box too. So many choices. Uh, yeah, look at that. Look how nice that is. Holographic box. 
for you to put all your nice cards in there. And oh, oh, there's all the stuff that we're looking for. All the good stuff as I eat my microphone. Put that down. Make it look nice. Put that off to the side. So here's our counter. Pretty basic. It's gray. Sorry, I'm not centered. I remember my camera's a little off to the side here. All right. Just your old basic counter. Okay, let's see. Take all these out. That to the side. All right, so we got our draft boosters. Our one collector booster pack. We'll save that one for last, of course. Got some regular cards, and then here are our basic lands and hollow lands. So uh, we'll just roll through that real quick. It's nice. Let's put the trash in the box in the front right there. All right, so we got our basic plains, island, swamp, mountain. Oh, sorry for the shine. Let me turn. Section. Boom. Mountain, forest, plains, island, swamp, mountain, or yada 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 yada. All the goods, all all the stuff you need. All the stuff you need to play. Cool. Love the lands. Oh, I. Uh, Hold on. As I'm opening this, I forgot to mention too that uh all oh, these cards got a little bent. Oh, that's upsetting. Well, that's a shame. I'm pushing back a little bit. That's tough to fix. It's a tough fix when you get when you get the bent cards. It's like, come on. Why did the cards bend? It's so sad. And they're all foils too. Uh so that's kinda it's kinda upsetting. Um uh, what was I going to say? That, uh, yeah, for your requested cards, if you subscribe and uh, follow me follow me on Twitter, uh, will be uh, given in a special uh, Caldheim card sleeve. You know, I'm going to give you a card unprotected. Uh, so uh, that's in the last video. I'll bring I'll bring it out for the end, maybe. I should be sleeving these cards. Hold on, let me, let me go grab that real quick. in the whole desk boom there they are the Caldheim card sleeves they look awesome and rats so all, all all the cards that are given away are given away in those Caldheim sleeves okay back to our our holographic lands and what is this Carrix the raging isle well, this is just this was this the legendary creature that I set up right off the box I lost I lost the wrap uh, outside of the I should pay attention to more things. Yeah, there's chairs. That's the one that comes with all, the, all these boxes. So, who is he? What does he do? Zero seventeen. Those are your opponents cast that target chair Raging I'll cost two more to cast. Chair gets plus X minus X until end of turn where X is the number of islands you control. Pretty cool. I never knew this card existed. That's awesome. Right. That's a special. That's a special card out of this deck right here. That I guess if you were able to get a gift edition, uh, you also, you know, everybody gets this card. But if you weren't able to get a gift, gift edition and you can't find them anywhere around you, it could be yours. It could be yours. And then boom, we got all holographic basic lands. Because that's everybody's favorite holographic card. I'm not going to waste time uh, sleeving all those right now. All right. So let's get to the first pack. Draft booster of Zendikar Rising. All right, here we go. Start it off. Scavenged Blade. Equipment card. Start starting off. Field research. Here's a blue. A little kick on it. Ooh, card action. Two cards or three cards have kicked. Core Celebrant. I've seen this guy around. Kazandu Stomper. Take some lands back into people's hands. 
Utility knife. Look at that. It's old. That's your uh, Magic the Gathering Swiss Army knife right there. You don't see that very often. Plus one, plus one. Equipment. Fizzling Barrage. Four damage target creature that blocked this turn. All right, good for you. Red users over there. Deadly Alliance. Red target creature or Planeswalker. Five drop. Pretty expensive. Pretty expensive five drop. Highborn Vampire. That's it. Four three. Dauntless Unity. Unity! Kick him out. Mind Carver. I really like that artwork. That's pretty cool. Like crazy shaman looking, looking thing right there. Eight or more cards of graveyard. Get a plus three, plus one. That's pretty cool. Goma Feta Vanguard. That ass bitch right there. Umaro is it? Umaro. Ooh, Phyleth World Sculptor. This card. Okay, when Phyleth World Sculptor enters the battlefield, create zero, one green plant creature token for each basic land you control. So, very coincidentally, I was just watching a video. Someone was uh, utilizing this card uh, with uh mystic reflection that is like the best combo for this maybe maybe we'll pull that get a little phyleth uh, mystic reflection combo going there where uh mystic reflection uh will copy any card uh you have in play uh when i believe uh, the language says uh, for each to you know whenever a token is put on the field so you can just make crazy amounts of like whatever card you want the guy the guy was playing it with righteous valkyrie and he racked up like three thousand life or something uh, i don't remember his name off the top of my head he's just he's some swedish uh, magic gathering player on, on youtube um mo uh was mo uh mono black spell i think that's his name Ooh, what's this guy right here skyclave shade full holographic kicker two black camp block it was kicked and just about with two plus one plus one counters on it and a landfall uh, is in your great whatever land answers about feeling control if it's in your graveyard it's your turn you may call, cast it from your grave, graveyard this turn so that's yeah that's a pretty easy way to get this card in and out in and out as needed for three one all right full, and look at that oh nice full uh full art forest and then this is just your uh blank card that you need right there awesome with this guy in his sleeve. Pretty decent card for uh for decent cards period for our, our first uh first draws right here. But yeah. Good card. Good card for combos, I'll tell you. Alright. Next pack. Okay, Cascade Seer. Farsight Adept. Tormenting Voice. Are you in there? I'm talking to you. Draw two cards. Uh, negate, okay. Have to target non creature spell. Good for any blue deck. Ghastly Gloom Hunter, the big bat. Flying in, lifelink, 1-1. One, one. Ooh, Territorial Scythe Cat. Trample and Landfall, nice. Expedition Diviner. Skyclave Squid, ooh. The full, full art, I think it might be. Might be. Ender Landfall. Canopy Baloth. 4 3 Landfall. It's plus 2 plus 2 on the turn. Nice. Nice. Wind Rider Wizard. Good ride that wind. Moss Pit Skeleton. Mine Carver again. 
Kazan Zandu Mammoth landfall. Whenever landers got under control, Kazandu Mammoth gets plus two, plus two, and then turn. I feel like we're going to see that a lot. Uh, the nice, uh, nice alt artwork right here. Very nice, very nice. And Adventure Awaits. Uh, we got a common holographic. The top five cards of the library, reveal a creature card from among them, and put it into your hand. Put the rest of the bottom of your library in random order. Didn't put a card into your hand this way. Draw a card. All right, not bad. And mount for our land. Okay, decent. Now I know. I think I could put the back two cards in the front so we can save the save the uh, whatever the holographic is for last. But uh, you know, I think Kinsano Mammoth is the, the big rare out of this. Next one. So some of the Strixhaven stuff has been uh, previews have been getting released, and some of the cards look pretty cool, especially uh, the. The Japanese alt artwork, oh man, it's just super cool looking. I'm 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 pumped for how that looks, but uh, you know, I'm sh there's so many things probably closest sold out, if not already sold out. All right, so we got Swampland, blank card, yo, uh, Molten Blast, two damage or destroy artifact, anti cognition, Angel Heart Protector. Torch Rider. Damn, how'd she do that? Little Strike? Oh my god. Ugh. Ugh, she lob up there. Ugh. Choose one or both. Why, why wouldn't you choose both? Why not? Minus one and plus one. Go for it. Go to Skycath. Alt Art. Cool, cool. I like, I like the diversity there. Rabid Bite. Tough card. Pressure Point. Got you. It's like some uh, Avatar stuff right here. Tap Creature and Draw a Card. Rotag Bug Catcher. That is a huge bug. That's not a bug. That thing's a dinosaur. What kind of bugs are on this goblin plan? That thing's a freaking dinosaur. Feed the swarm. Pair tactician. Fine gecko. Skyclave cleric. And just here, just just two life. Go for it. Two life. And inscription of abundance, not holographic, but there is our. Uh, rare card. Okay. A uh, little bummer of a deck. A little bummer of a or pack right there. Yeah. A couple alt arts, though. Next one. So, again, reminding everybody about the giveaway. Still open from the Caladime one. Tacking on 10 more uh, from, from this one. So, that means there's 16 cards that could still are, are still out. For grabs for everybody. Full art island. Meow cat. All right, here we go. Predicted tactics. Ooh. One white drop instant. Choose target attack or blocking creature. Practice tactics deals damage to that creature. Equal twice the number of creatures in your party. Ooh, ooh. I can help uh, late game. Fissured wizard. Nimana skitter sneak. Oh, I thought it was the creature, but it's just, it's the, it's the dude in the back. And Zandu Nectar Pot. Seagate Banneret. Air Supplies. Scale the Heights. Some uh, Dawn Wall stuff right there. Shepherd of Heroes. Not a bad card. Just expensive. Got a five drop on that. And it's about feeling you gain two life for each creature in your party. So you gotta have a pretty diverse deck for this, I guess, because you have to have Cleric Rogue, Warrior, Wizard. And that'll give you the maximum life out of that. Nimana Sky Dancer. Flash Flying. And Mills two cards. 
cleric of the chill depths. You know, not, not those uptight depths, the chill ones. Relic axe. Spring mantle cleric. Bastwood fortification. And Thieving Skydiver, Picker, X, X can't be zero. Thieving Skydiver enters the battlefield with kick, gaining 12 target artifact with converted mana cost X or less. Equipment, attach it to Thieving Skydiver. No hollow. Bummer. Bummer. Get in the next one. Do it. All right, here we go. Next pack. Gonna get something good out of here. So, uh, I was very determined to try and get up to Mythic rank for the last season and Magic Gathering for you know the month of March. Not get there. Got to tier one diamond. Uh, couldn't couldn't break the mold into uh, Mythic, unfortunately. So, I have to grind through April again. Killing trap. Bira Outrider. Inordinate Rage. I'm so angry. She's a little mask, bro. Her creature gets plus three, plus two until end of turn. Scry one. Mind Drain. It's a pretty good card. Starts two cards, mills a card, lose one life, and you gain a life. Gnarled Colony. A lot of good kicker cards here. Spent the Solidarity. Let go, Indy. Let it go. <laughs> Royal Eruption. Another kicker. Three damage to any target. If spell was kicked, deals five damage. Oof. Oof. Don't work, Pack Beast. Look at that. Guy was way ahead of uh, Death Stranding here. Oh, also a cleric, rogue, warrior, and wizard. Ah, so with the. Angel that we just pulled before. If this guy, well, I guess it only counts for one. I don't know how that works. Do it count for everything or do it count for one? Put it in the comments. Let me know. Ooh, Malakir Blood Priest. Opponent loses X life and you gain X life where X is the number of creatures in your party. Nice, dude. Easy with the face paint. Disenchant. Very nice. Destroy your artifact or enchantment. Two drop on that. Nice. Go my fader vanguard again. Relic axe. All right. All right. Getting some repeats here. Song mad treachery. Gain control of target creature until end of turn. Untap that creature. Gains haste until end of turn. And land on the back. Oh, you see the card already? Uh, Song mad ruin. Song mad ruin. I feel tapped at, at, uh, at a red. And what was this? Guy clay shade. I think we already got this one. Okay. Okay. Okay, no hollow. Come on. We want the nice cards. I want to put. I want to. I want to use. I want to use the sleeves. Oh, jeez. I just camera. I want to, I want to use. Please, please let me use the sleeves. All right, here we go. Next one. Not too many this time. Last time it was thirty-two packs. Thirty-two packs, and we went over an hour. Bananas, bananas. This time it's only eleven. It's gonna be a little quicker. Polar Forest. Blank. Okay. Tazim Royal Mage. Names these people. Merfolk Wizard. Pyroclastic Hellion. Only Hellions I know are from StarCraft 2. Shout, shout out to StarCraft 2. Shell Shield. And defense on there. Drana Silencer. That's you. Huh. Friggin' vampire ninja. He's six drop. Oh, oh. Charlie Colony. Took took rubble fort. And these names. Wild stuff. Wild stuff. Mankindi ox. Landfall. When land is battlefield control, tap target creature and opponent controls. 
Glacial Grasp. Hold out there. Feed the Swarm. Inserted Defense. Lol Mage Familiars. Add a green or blue. Whenever you cast a kick spell, you gain two life. Huh. Paleka Predation. Target opponent reveals their hand. You choose a card from it. We convert it. Man, cost three or greater. That player discards that card. And it's an ugly looking thing. And then I think we got a land. On, ooh, ooh, little land on the back. Paleka Caverns. I think it's just yeah, bad black. Cool. Scoot Swarm. Landfall. Whenever land enters battlefield, you control create a 1 1 green insect creature token. Control six or more lands. A token that's a copy of Scoot Swarm instead. Hey, goes back to. Um, Mystic Reflection. Good combo. Good combo with this guy. I know it's a good combo because somebody did it to me. So many. I don't remember. I think it was Coma Serpent. I think Com they did it with Coma Serpent and there was just you know Coma Serpent is 6-6 six, six giant dragon. Yeah, I lost. And the last card. Oh, here we go. Highborn Vampire. Uh, basic card, though. All right, we got a basic hollow. 4-3, four, 4 drop. Good. Oh, good. This is a gift box. I, I'm expecting good gifts here. Not basic hollows. Show me the money. Friday Night Magic. Anybody actually? How's Friday Night Magic been going with uh, the pandemic? Uh, I I never participated in a real life event. I would love to once, you know, once everything's over, uh, you know, just to actually get to meet people and you know play in real life. You know, I'm, I'm probably going to buy more cards, but you know what? We'll buy more cards. No problem there. Tormenting voice. Stop yelling. Stop yelling. This guy. Okay. Okay. He's had enough. Negate. Practice tactics. Marauding Blade Priest. I like this card a lot. I like it a lot. Vampire Cleric. Whenever you gain life, your opponent loses one life. 3-2-3 three, three drop. Yeah, that's a really good card. I like it. I didn't realize it was only a basic. I thought it was uh, a little more rare than that. But that's cool. That's cool. You get a lot of those, you know, racked up in an uh, in arena. Or... Uh, you know, any decks that you have that are using life to to take away a life. All that good stuff. Black, black, white decks like that. Broken Wings. Ran a silencer again. There's that uh, Vampire Ninja. Tuck Tuck Rubble Fort. Glacial Grass. All right, here we go. A lot of doubles here. Blood Chief's Thirst. I don't think we got this one. Point four. Sorcery. Kicker. Destroy target creature. Planeswalker. Mana cost two or less. If it was kicked, destroy... Destroy target creature or planeswalker. So, yep, kick it or, or just, yeah. I read it. You know. Scatter Skull Minotaur. Oh, man. Oh, man. Don't mess with that guy. Five, four, six drop. It'll cost one less to cast for each creature in your party. Nice. Nice. Core Blade Master. Double Strike. Oh, and Equip Warriors you have. I have double strike. I guess just equip warriors. Man, she's ripped. Don't mess with her. Glass pool. Mimic. Land on the back. Big ship to rogue. May have glass pool. Mimic. Enter the battlefield as a copy of a creature you control, except it's a shapeshifter rogue into its other types. Oh, no. that explains the zero zero there. It's land on the back, but we got could be the holographic on the back. So I'm gonna wait to flip it, and we have ooh. Roost of Drakes. Well, first we'll show the land on the back. Glass Bull Shore. We got a blue out of that. All right, so it's uncommon. Full holographic. Roost of Drakes. Kicker, two blue. When Roost of Drakes enters the battlefield, if it was kicked, create a 2 2 blue Drake creature. Took him a flying. Or if you cast a kick spell, create another one. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, but it's only, a, it's, only, it's only one blue. It's only one blue. That's a good spell. Good stuff. I'll take that one. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, 
Oops, I messed up. Oh, <laughs> sorry, I revealed it right away. Uh, all right, well, okay, well, there's the car. Brush fire elemental. elemental. Uh, one one haste. Red green drop. Can't be blocked by creatures of power to a less than landfall. Sorry, we put that off to the side. I guess, uh, I guess it didn't have like the. Oh no, I just, I just grabbed too many cards. All right, island blank. I'll go through this one quickly then. Angel Heart Protector. Torch Rider. Killing Trap. Reclaim the Waste. Who wants to reclaim the Waste? Nobody wants to do that. Marauding Blade Priest. Pressure Point. Ooh, Spitfire Legac Alt Art. That's pretty cool with Landfall. I like that card. I like that a lot. Now here he's Binding. And this is Zendikon. Got a school Minotaur. Core Blade Master. And Vastwood, oh, Vastwood Fortification. And one more. Ooh, Verizal, the Split Current. Look at that. Two. I guess this is the rare out of this. Verizal, the Split Current. Enters the battlefield plus one, plus one counter on it for each mana spent to cast it. Ah. Explains the X. Whenever you cast a kick spell, you may remove two plus one plus one counters from Verizal if you do copy that spell. You may choose new targets for the copy. Real versatile card right here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Anybody getting upset that I'm putting the uh, Zen card cards in the uh, Cal time? That's ah, cool, right? It's cool. All right, almost there. Make sure we only two, only two. Full swamp. Copy. All right, Fissure Wizard. Azim Royal Mage. Expedition Healer. Might of Marassa. Is that a frog? Oh my god. Oh, he's just getting like all magicked up. Marassa. That makes sense. Blood Beckoning. Gale Heights. Shepherd of Heroes. The Mana Sky Dancer. Two cards? No. Look, it's a thick. Cleric of Chill Depths. Chill as hell. Skyclave Sentinel. It's a pretty cool looking dragon. Oh, he's a gargoyle. My bad, my bad. I kick my ass now. Rooster Drakes. Cargan War Leader. Other warriors get plus one plus one. Pretty good. Three drop and three three. Tangle Flora Hedron. Reach Elemental. And there's a I think green land in the back. Let's see what we got here. Linvala Shield of Seagate. And then, uh yep, those are green. Enters tapped. Linvala. The shield. Got a lot going on there. At the beginning of combat on your turn, if you have a full party, choose target not land permanent and opponent controls. Until your next turn, it can't attack a block. It's act activated. Those can't be activated. Sacrificer. Choose hexproof or indestructible. Creatures gain that until end of the turn. All right. All right. Little cool angel was there. But they're not holographic. I want the good looking cards. Maybe some alt arts. Things people don't have. Because I want to give it away. That's, that's what I want to do. I want to have my enjoyment transfer to other people. Got a full island. Blank card for whatever you want. Could be our outrider. In order to enrage. Into the royal. The Juru Blade Blade. Oblivion's Hunger. Oh my god, who is she? Malakir Blood Priest. The Sin Chant. Shepherd Heroes again. Living Tempest. I think that's new. Flash Flying 3 3. Turn Timber Aesthetic. Cedic. Aesthetic. Not aesthetic. Whole different word. Taunting Arbor Mage, like 
can be taunted by an Arbor Mage. If anything's going to taunt me, I didn't think an Arbor Mage would do it. Relic Golem. Malakir Rebirth. And Morag, Fury of Akam. Mythic Rare. Not holographic, though. Each creature control gets plus one, plus zero for each time it has attacked this turn. And landfall. When a land enters the battlefield under your control, if it's your main phase, there's an additional combat phase after this phase. What? At the beginning of that combat, untap all, ooh, untap all creatures you control. What? Damn. Damn, that's intense. That's intense. All right, gotta pull out all the good juju for this one. Collector Booster Zendikar Rising. Get something good. Last pack. Good stuff. Oh Jesus! Show me the stuff right away. Okay, mate. All right, maybe this is the order, order to go right here. Got it. Here we go. Looking good. All right, we got everything here is going to be holographic. Insect. Oh, we just started out with that. Oh, what's on the back? Drake. I know Drake was going to be in my deck. Sing me a song, Drake. Chilling Trap. Oblivion's Hunger. Oh my gosh, looks even better holographic. Skyclave Sentinel. Gargoyle, not a dragon. Vanquish the Weak. Rising Riptide. Allied Assault. Cool, pretty cool. Sulundi Vision with a land. Lundi Isle. Full Swamp. Ondu Inversion. Full Art. Needle Verge Pathway. A rare land with another land on the back. Pillar Verge Pathway. Akum Hellhound, full art. Prowling Felidar, full art. Or alt art. Clearwater Pathway, on the back. Murkwater Pathway. Dead Worm. And is this going to be anything good? Let's hope for something good. Rare, Mythic Rare. See what we get. Woo! Grackmaw Skyclave Ravager. Nice. That's pretty cool. Enters battlefield with three plus one plus one counters on it. Whenever another creature you control dies, if it had a plus one plus one counter on it, put another one on Grackmaw. When he dies, create XX black and green Hydro creature token. Rex's number of plus one plus one counters on the old Grackmaw. It just keeps going. That's why he's a Hydra. And only three drop. Nice. That's pretty. Good card to end on. You know what? I'm happy with that. And we're going to have to throw sleeves on all these guys. I'll throw it, I'll throw it on Grackmaw right off the bat. He deserves it. All of his heads deserve it. You deserve it. And that right there. Oops, wrong one. Is our... Zendikar Rising Gift Edition Box. I hope there was something in there that you liked. Uh, again, subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter. And any card that I drew today could be yours. Uh, on his first, first come, first serve basis, I will DM you on Twitter. I'll work out the uh, shipping details. Uh, you know, I won't ask you to pay for anything. I'll, I'll send out everything all, all on my own. Uh, I had a Really awesome turnout uh, the last time. I actually got a good amount of people from Argentina. Super cool. They didn't know that it was, uh, you know, 
that noticed uh, down there. So really happy he was able to send it out there. So uh, with that in mind, and if you saw the comment on the last video, I, I am willing to ship international. I, I have some international stamps. You know, luckily cards don't weigh that much. And, uh, you know, I'll, I'll get, I'll get in the mail and, you know, it might take a little while, but it'll get, it'll get out there and it'll, it'll get to you. And, uh, you know, and then, and then in addition to the full box openings I'm doing, I'm uh, going to start a new, uh, shorter videos, uh, called three pack quickies where I, uh, uh, just open up three packs real quick and the giveaway always, uh, applies to all, applies to all the videos. And, uh, next one, uh, might be Pokemon because I, Finally found one. I said I wasn't gonna do Pokemon because they were impossible to find, but I actually found it, so I want to do it now. So, I'll look out for the three pack quickie. It's gonna be uh, uh, Pokemon decks, and then I'll do uh, more Magic the Gathering after that. So, uh, thanks for uh, coming by the happy hour, and you have a great you have a good one.